Okay, so uh, this is round one. We obviously didn't draw mm, the correct land, so we're gonna mulligan. Uh, two blue. We obviously need to keep. We don't. We don't need that. We need red mana. Sure. All right, we got red. Playing magic now. Sa I mean, salvage drone. I mean, it's gonna ingest some stuff. I'm not. I don't really care that much about that. Um, our hand seems like we should be able to to do some stuff here. Next turn we get to play Cultivator Drone, turn this guy off. So we didn't play anything on three. There's a counter spell. always trigger to this. So if he has the counter spell, make him use it on this. Oh, well he doesn't have it, so Okay. Um we will never need these two. What do we got? Mm, there's something that does damage I don't know about. Okay. Put it on top of my deck and then ingest it? Sure. Still has nothing. Yup. So he's obviously dealing with some mana issues here. Yep. I'm surprised he might like if I mean, he might attack, try to draw a discard. Do anything. I mean, we can just play this game, I guess. We have lots of big monsters that we can draw to, so. Okay. I'm super tempted to just not even block. But that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, sure. I mean, he needs mana. Even if he draws mana, I mean, I'm still really far ahead. Okay. 
like I mean, there's there's a thought process that says we could just have like done this to get the damage in and try to draw to something because we are so far ahead. Um, but I feel like him at 19 and I'm at 17, like... I just don't see that being real life. Like, I can draw a lot of stuff. Thought Harvester. Whenever you cast a colorless spell, target opponent exiles top card. Okay. We're going to kill that. Man, every land in the frickin' deck. Alright, this does 5 damage. Um... Yeah, I just... I'm just gonna keep attacking and then... I mean, hopefully, I mean, we can't just draw lands for the rest of this game, like, we've drawn eight, so we've gone through ten there, so ten, we've gone through ten lands so far, all right, well, this makes things a lot better, okay, so we can... Slip this guy. Okay. Let's get some attacking going. You don't want to block him. And then let's try to draw out of this. Okay, that guy does absolute nothing. Yep. Fifteen all, and I've... I get to draw cards. Still draw a card EOT. Okay, let's. I feel a little better. I mean, I'm not sure what mass removal is uh, is out there. Uh, he's got five cards in hand. Still can't use this. So, I mean, I don't know if there's something that does three damage to everything. I mean, there could be. I just don't know. I literally have no idea what what I'm up against. So. I just figure I can build my board, draw some cards, tap his guys down, and since I've drawn infinite land, um, I mean, this is probably only going to get in one time. Brutal Explosion. Alright, so... Okay. That could have been much worse. Oh, yeah, that adds mana, so he can tap a creature. Okay. Tapper. Two, three, four. 
before, so we can play Slide Runner. Um, do I care? It's going to be another land, it's fine. And a turn tap this guy. Nope. Okay. Four cards. Let's dodge craziness. Okay, I don't care about infiltrator. Sixteen cards left. Okay, so yep, I'll be blocking. Let's draw. One, two, three, four. Man, we literally have drawn all the lands in the world. Um, three, two, twin, four. Uh, all right, so. Five, six. And then end of turn, we'll tap his tapper, try to finish this game off before it gets too crazy. I guess he could return a land. That the spell I used. Negative six. Well. Well, fine. <laughs> um, yeah, you want to come over? Come on over. Okay, so if we tap this guy. A 50. I think we just want to keep pressing the advantage. Uh, okay, so let's do actually. Oh, that doesn't work. I need to tap this guy. What? Oh, I guess he could just flow to the mana. Oh, thanks. Thanks for making me... Making me not as bad. Uh, blue, red, storm chaser. Can... Metal. I think what's now? I think cast with surge, get out, always yield. And we have a huge wall. He's at 10, we get it. All right. So we mulliganed, um, his hand was really bad because he got mana screwed and ended up just overwhelming the board. I mean, 
the deck's still bad. So let's uh, let's see what we have um, against him. I'm just wondering, unity of purpose. I mean, this card could be really insane against him. Hmm. I mean, I'm not sure how how slow his deck is going to be. I mean, because we might cut this guy and play this guy instead. Yeah, I think that's fine. I mean, just gives us a late game if the match keeps going like it's going. So, all right, let's uh, get into the next game and see what we can do.